Hello. Thanks for calling Low Value Mail. What up? Hello. What's up? It's the hard money troll, motherfucker. The hard money troll. I haven't heard from you in a while. How you been, man? Yeah, dude. What's up? I don't know what the uh, what topic is tonight. The topic is, is tonight is the worst you've ever been scammed. Oh, so like Voyager or FTX? Is that correct? Like, I was that, in both. That why? I was involved in both of them. Yeah. Well, you made life changing money on the uh, Hard Money's Million. I mean, not on the Hard Money's Million Dollar Podcast. Oh, uh, also, can I uh, can I uh, give a shout out? Sure. Shouting out you, Matt St. Combe. He wimp. doesn't listen to this. Well, no shit, he doesn't, because there's people threatening him on it. Why would? They? Why? Oh, would you're he? saying you're the person who's threatening him? I mean, I'm alluding to it. You're alluding to threatening him. Okay, that's fine. I Anyways, mean, how's it going? What's the what's the worst? That, what's the worst you ever been scammed, Hard Money Troll? I mean, I no, nobody know, even dude. knows what Hard Money is. Yeah, I mean, it that's even so exist funny. Anymore. Yeah, well, the the funniest thing is that Chinese story you just told you right there. I've heard you tell on a different. It's yes. funny. Do you ever do it, it? Do you have a lot of crossover on like your audiences, like the hard money audience? Do they usually? No, there is no hard camp? money. There is no hard money audience. Well, I mean, there was. There was you for, gave a, up. for briefly, and then it ended. Man, you you were what I was all about, bro, and then you quit. How? Could well, you it was do in the middle of us? the. Pa- I didn't quit. It was in the middle of the pandemic, and I was just like, well, not, what not- happened? Well, just, also, we, we shout just, out to Chris Benedict, wherever you are, bro. I actually, miss you, bro. Yeah, Chris Benedict. Shout out to Chris. Um, yeah, I love that guy. I know. I actually talked to him today. Uh, anyway. Well, I, I call him all the time. He never picks up. Uh, hard and to I, believe. That's absolutely. Hard that's to believe. Absolutely okay, hard money serious. troll. Worst you've ever yeah. been scammed. Uh, I don't know. Maybe that time you wouldn't call Felipe Esparza. Huh? <laughs> so people don't Can know. Call- you work in production. For or something like that, or something yeah. like this in the comedy entertainment industry, and then you were regularly DMing me, being like, "Hey, I'm with this comedian. Do you want his number?" Yeah, and Danny is like, "No, I don't want the fucking number." I'm like, not just cold how, calling Felipe. How ungrateful Esparza. can you be, Danny? Well, why not? He was cool <laughs> shit. All right, let me tell let me tell you this, dude. All right, so I get a phone call from some other dude at a different venue, and like we're talking, and he's going like. Oh yeah, everybody that comes through here is great, you know. Oh, but we did have Felipe Esparza, and he fucking hotboxed our green room, and you know we're a city venue, so it's a big deal. And my first thought was, that's right, Felipe Esparza smokes mad weed, right? Yeah. And so he comes, and so he's in the green, you know, he's in the green room, and I'm kind of passing through because I have to. And he goes, uh, he goes, oh, you know, I know, no, that I can't smoke cigarettes, but like if I smoke some weed, is that cool? And I was like. Oh yeah! Not only is that like cool, I have like a bunch of joints rolled for us to smoke. And dude, I should you not. I hung out with him like forty minutes, at least three different times through the night to uh, to just chain smoke joints and just like all he was doing was just watching comedy and chain smoking joints and talking about the craft. You would love him, Dan. I'm not but, saying I wouldn't love him. I'm saying I know. No, comedians. you said your audience would not like him, which Who's, I think is a bit said, racist. I didn't say my audience would not like him. Yeah, you're no, like, I I you're saying on the, on the like boys him. cast. I don't know if he's a, I don't know. Like, is he that popular? I don't know. I, I don't know about that. More know. importantly, I'm not just calling him. I'm not just cold calling him. Uh, you know, I, I could I, just I DM came, him. I came this cl- Yeah, like he'd answer your DMs. And like he wouldn't answer my phone calls. <laughs> yeah, he would. From an unknown I mean, number? I don't answer seems, unknown numbers. I mean, I feel you. like he gets less phone calls than DMs on Facebook and whatnot, right? Yeah. Probably. Probably. I don't, I don't know. know. I came this close to having him call you and wish you happy birthday. That would be nice. My birthday is December yeah. 12th. You can have him call me and wish me a happy birthday. Is on, your birthday on... December 12th? It might be. It might Wait, not be. Well, what are we doing for Danny's birthday, everybody? I'm, I think I'm gonna save that in one of my phones right now because I got multiple phones, Danny. I'm sure I'll you just do have hard one control. phone. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Well, All right, thanks well, for calling in. I appreciate oh, it. Well, you're kicking me off. Well, we got to keep the show moving so along. Long. It's a show about pretty, scams. Pretty cool. Hey, everybody who's listening, don't get a friendship with Danny. He'll just cut you off. He'll like, you know, we talk all the time in DM. Yeah, all right, all right. Well, I'll send you. Uh, I'll send you. Uh, oh, who's coming? Send me. Uh, you I know what? I you want to impress me? Send me Hunter Biden's phone number, and then we'll talk. I mean, you really want Hunter Biden's phone number? Yes. You're... 
he would be he would be a great he would come on the boys he would cast, be a solid right? hang we would have hunter biden on the boys cast in a second yeah, he's, I the, really ulti- he's that. the ultimate dog dude he's such a dog he's the so ultimate true. dog all, all right, right. thanks well, buddy well nice talking later later